This is Garden of Maine. And this building is Johnson Hall. It's been on this spot since 1864. Me, I'm Rick DeSedlo. I'm co-chair of the Capital Campaign Committee here at Johnson Hall. And we're fixing the upstairs and this great old lady. I have an idea I want to share with you. Let's go in and take a look. Wow, look at this place. I get the goosebumps every time I come up here. Wow, wow, look at this place. This is the upstairs I was telling you about, boys and girls. 400 seat theater coming here. World class performers right on that stage in Gardner Bay. Vaudeville used to happen here. Can you imagine that? Vaudeville. Like Calvin Coolidge was president or somebody like that. I mean, that goes back a ways. It's older than me. Then it turned into a movie theater. I guess it was cool, but kind of a crime, as it really was built for live performance. This is pretty much probably the way it looked in 1956 when it went out of use. I can't even begin to tell you. I get goosebumps, look at me. How excited we are to get this project done. But for me tonight, it's not the most exciting thing I'm going to talk to you about. It is not the most exciting thing. This, this is the best part. As you probably, or hopefully at least, can tell, I'm pretty passionate about fixing the upstairs of this theater and bringing in some world-class acts. The other thing I've always wanted to do, I wanted to own a bar, and I wanted to name it Rick's Cafe. I know that's not the most original name, but just stay with me here for a minute. There's naming rights here. The bar's gonna be right here in this space. The naming rights for the bar are $100,000. I do not have $100,000. I don't even have half of $100,000. But I got to thinking, what if I could find 99 like-minded Ricks that all put up $1,000 and together we could own Rick's Cafe? Don't exclude the ladies. We'll take Erica's or Ricky's. Richard's, mm, not so sure. You know how they can be, but that's a whole nother story. Imagine our names all emblazoned here on the grand facade. Forever, in memoriam, in perpetuity, eternally even. And the best thing about it, when you come to a show here, we'll give you your first drink for free. PBR, PBR, we're trying to impress these people here. You hand me a freaking PBR? Cut. What the hell is wrong with you? Cut. And the very best part is, when you come here to Johnson Hall, the first drink is on us. Ha-ha! <laughs> Boston Spine is Sam Adams. Now we're talking. Oh, Ricks, let's get this done. And here's how we do it. Oh, by the way, I'm on the stage at the Studio Theater at Johnson Hall, where we do over 50 shows a year. Most of them are sold out. Many of the performers do two shows. But if you want to help us renovate that upstairs and become an owner of Rick's Cafe by donating $1,000, here's how you can do it. You can call this phone number, go to this website, or you can email me. I'm the head Rick at this email address right here. Stop by Johnson Hall anytime our season's starting up pretty soon. And if you mentioned you saw this, you'll get your free beer. Let's do this.